Listen, you've been lied to. Everyone tells you to just switch your PC to ultimate performance and boom, FPS unlocked, right? Wrong, that's only scratching the surface. Windows actually hides a ton of secret power plan settings that control your CPU, latency, and how your PC handles gaming. And if you don't unlock and tweak them, you're leaving performance on the table. So today, I'm gonna show you five hidden Windows power tweaks, some are registry hacks, some are command line tricks, that take your system from just ultimate performance to true maximum performance. Let's get into it. Step one. Unlock all hidden power settings in Windows. Most people don't realize this. When you look at your Windows advanced power settings, you're only seeing about 20% of what's really there. Microsoft hides the rest. Things like CPU core parking, processor idle states, and latency tolerance controls, because they're not for average users. But if you're gaming, these hidden settings are exactly where the performance gains are buried. Before we optimize anything, we need to unhide them. Open CMD as administrator. Press Win plus S, type CMD. Right click, run as administrator. Enter these commands, copy paste each line. Each GUID here corresponds to a hidden processor feature. Idle states, C states that can add input lag, core parking, decides when Windows parks CPU cores, latency tolerance, how aggressively Windows trades responsiveness for efficiency. Now go to Control Panel, Power Options, Change Plan Settings, Advanced Power Settings. You'll now see new hidden categories like Processor Idle, Performance Core Parking, and Latency Tolerance. This sets the stage. The rest of the steps will tweak these for FPS. Step 2. Disable CPU core parking and throttling. Registry plus UI. One of the sneakiest causes of micro stutter and input lag in Windows is how the OS tries to help your CPU. By default, Windows constantly adjusts your processor's activity, parking idle cores, throttling performance states, and prioritizing energy efficiency. That's fantastic for laptops on battery, but for gaming, it's a silent FPS killer. When Windows parks a core, your game has to wait for that core to wake up. That can mean delays of a few milliseconds per frame, which is the difference between buttery smooth and stuttery gameplay. So here's how we kill that behavior and force Windows to keep all your cores awake, clocked, and responsive. One. Use the hidden power settings, UI method. Since you already unlocked the hidden settings in step one, let's put them to work. Go to Control Panel, Power Options, Change Plan Settings, Advanced Power Settings, Expand Processor Power Management. Now change these. Processor Performance Core Parking Men Cores, 100%. This disables core parking entirely all cores stay online. Processor performance throttle policy, performance. This prevents windows from sneaky down clocking under load. No more balanced nonsense. This alone eliminates one of the biggest causes of stutter spikes in CPU bound games. Two, registry backup and safety net. Before tweaking the registry, make a backup. Press Win plus R, Type regedit, hit enter. Click File, Export, save your full registry backup. Now go deeper. Navigate to Inside here, look for keys with GUIDs like Core Parking, Processor Throttle Policy. Open Attributes, then change the value from 1 to 0. This ensures they always stay visible in Power Options even if Windows tries to re-hide them in future updates. Result? All cores stay awake, ready to fire instantly. No lag spikes when Windows randomly decides to wake a core mid-game. Step 3. Fix CPU idle latency. Hidden processor idle policy. By default, Windows aggressively manages CPU idle states. C states. 
when your CPU isn't doing much, it'll nap by entering deeper idle modes. Each deeper still saves more power, but the wake-up latency increases. That means when you flick your mouse in Valorant or Apex, your CPU might take a few extra microseconds to wake. Multiply that across thousands of frames and you feel it as input delay or micro stutter. For gaming, we want zero hesitation. The CPU should be awake, alert, and ready 24-7 while you're in-game. 1. Unlock the hidden options. If you followed step 1, you've already revealed these in Power Options using Power CFG. Go to Control Panel, Power Options, Change Plan Settings, Advanced Power Settings. Expand Processor Power Management. 2. Change the idle policy. Processor idle disable to enabled. This prevents Windows from parking or idling your CPU cores at all. What this does, your CPU is always ready. No half-asleep cores, no micro-freeze when you flick your mouse or hit a key. Step 4. Enable True High Performance Mode via CMD. Even Ultimate Performance leaves some bottlenecks. We'll unlock a custom clan with no idle, no throttling, max responsiveness. CMD trick. Open CMD as admin. Paste this to duplicate Ultimate Performance and give it a new ID. This creates a clone plan we can mod without breaking the default one. Rename it for clarity. Now tune it. Translation, no idle, 100% cores, boost mode aggressive, no throttling. This becomes your dedicated gaming power plan. Step 5. Bonus Timer Tweaks By now, we forced Windows to keep all CPU cores awake and stopped it from parking or throttling. But there are one more hidden switches that trim off the last bits of latency, stuff most gods completely ignore. 1. Global Timer Resolution Registry Tweak Windows system timer resolution is usually 10 to 15 milliseconds, but games and tools like ISLC or timer resolution requested to be lowered to 0.5 milliseconds for faster input responsiveness. Problem, Windows doesn't always allow it consistently. This registry tweak makes sure apps always get the lowest possible system timer resolution by default, reducing input delay. And that's it. You've just unlocked Windows hidden power settings and built yourself a true max performance power plan. No more lazy CPU cores, no more idle states adding lag, and no more fake ultimate performance mode. If this video helped you, drop a like so more gamers can see it, and let me know in the comments which tweak made the biggest difference for you. And if you want the full script with all the CMD and registry commands, I'll leave it in the description. Subscribe if you're serious about squeezing every drop of FPS and responsiveness out of your system. I'll see you in the next one. Peace!